Hello, Math 1224. This is Dr. Patterson, and this is the first of, I hope, many videos that I'll be recording for this class. Uh, before I get started, let me mention that I am recording this on my Samsung Galaxy Tab S2 using an app called Explain Everything, which I got for pretty cheap, I have to say. Uh, so this app lets you record videos on a virtual whiteboard. Uh, as you can see, I can write stuff and also use my voice and record all of this and transform it at the end of this process into a video. Uh, I'll have you know this is like my fifth or sixth take, so I tend to be super perfectionist uh, when I'm recording these things. I, and I hope that actually works to your benefit. Hopefully by the time I'm through with each video, it'll be fairly polished and organized and it'll go up exactly the way I wanted it, as opposed to class where everything sort of spews out of my mouth at random and if it makes sense, so be it. And if not, then you're sort of out of luck. Anyway, uh, let me say a little bit about the two types of videos I plan to post here. So the two types of videos, uh, the first one is something called a lesson supplement. So that's just going to be what it sounds like. A lesson supplement is an opportunity for me to extend or build on something that I did in class. Or maybe I just did something in class that I felt wasn't as clear as it could be, and this is a chance for me to clarify it and also have it in video form so that you can review it if you want to, go back through it multiple times and work through things at your own pace. Uh, lesson supplements will be there for your reference. Uh, you're not required to view them, but I certainly recommend it. Now the other type of video I plan to post, this is actually something where I want to see some class participation, something called a lesson launch. So a lesson launch will be something that I'll post prior to a lecture or prior to a day of class and actually ask you to view it before class. Now I plan to make these videos, I hope, no more than about three to five minutes long because I think that's about the right size for one of these videos. But I may post a few of them. I may post about 15 minutes worth of video divided into three to five minute chunks. Now with lesson launches, there's an assignment for you. The assignment is not mandatory, but it's one of those things I'm gonna ask you to do in order to earn coins for exam retakes at the end of the semester. Uh, so the way that this will work is there'll be an assignment Let's see, switch colors there. There'll be an assignment in Blackboard for each lesson launch. Uh, hopefully for approximately each day of class or at least every other day of class. So the assignment will be pretty open-ended actually. The assignment's gonna be to write a bit about the lesson launch. Now when I say write a bit, what exactly do I mean? I realize that's a bit vague. But what I mean is I want you to actually watch the entire video, make sense of it, and then write something which would convince me that you've watched the video and made sense of it. That's, that's it. The assignment's really as simple as that. And the something that you write could be a question you have about the video, or it could be what you learned from the video, Or you could just uh, you could just uh, resummarize what was in the video in your own words. Really, the way that you do this is up to you. Now, let me say a little bit about what won't suffice on this assignment. When I say a question, I don't mean just post a question saying, "I watched the video. I couldn't make any sense of it." Uh, you have to do more than that. You have to do something which would demonstrate to me that you've watched the video and you've at least dug into it a little bit. And, and if you find it completely impossible to do that with a video, you certainly have recourse. You can email me, you can come see me in office hours, uh, but whatever you post for this has to convince me that you've watched the video and made at least some a priori sense of it. Okay, now the way the assignment will work is uh, I'll, I'll read what you've written and depending upon the quality of what you've written and whether it convinces me that you've, uh, that you've actually watched and made sense of the video, I'll award you either one or two coins for each class uh, for which you've posted a lesson launch reflection. All right, and the one to two coins will be based on quality. All right, so the way that I plan to structure this, let's see if I can zoom out there. Oh, that's nice. I'm starting to like this app quite a bit. Anyway, the way that things will be structured is uh, in, in Blackboard, under the videos folder, 
I'll have lesson supplements for each lesson, and I'll have lesson launches for each lesson. So in this particular case, you should look for some sequence of lesson launches for day, uh, let's see, this is going to be day three of class coming up. So I'll post some sequence of lesson launches, probably not more than about three of them. And then someplace separate, I will post an assignment. Oh, what happened to my pen? There we go. Where I ask you to reflect upon lesson launch three as a whole, which will per pertain to all three of those. Anyway, so your job is uh, sometime prior to class, write a brief reflection on what you saw, and then post it in the appropriate assignment Dropbox. Uh, you'll get better at this as we go along. Uh, and in fact, that's, that's probably a good guiding principle for this whole thing, is that at first, you might write reflections that don't tell me a whole lot about what kind of sense you made of the video. That's okay. Uh, you're going to get better at this as we go along, and I'll try and give you feedback that helps you get better at it. But I think that act of metacognition will really help you to understand at least the first bit of mathematics that we're doing in class. And that'll make our time in class more productive, or at least, you know, that's the, that's the hope anyway. So anyway, that's an intro to uh, how I'll be using videos this semester. I hope that you enjoy this and find it useful. Uh, if you have any suggestions about how I can make the videos more useful, please don't hesitate to let me know. This is my first adventure with this, and I'm not exactly Salman Khan here, but I'm hoping that I'll be able to create a resource that you will enjoy using and that you'll find helpful. Anyway, that's it for this video. Uh, please stay tuned for Lesson Launch 3.01.